That's awesome. And this is why I found around that paleo field hmm. are these weird. Yeah, I see them. Geoforms. Land. Yeah. I contacted the state um, geologist, and they said they were uh, glacial deposits. But I didn't tell them about some of the stuff I found around them. Like this right here. I'll show you next time. Uh, next one. These are walls. Oh. And these are like the, um, the land masses or Al- know, almost like really mounds. Cold. Yeah. <laughs> like, um, yeah, those remind me of uh, like some of the mounds that are in the, um, I'm trying to remember the name of the book, but uh, monuments in North America or whatever. There's all these weird. Yeah. The Mississippi just, Valley mounds. Yeah. 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 It's kind of what I was thinking too. Um, but this is, uh, label this one wall A and that's wall B. That's wall A. This is facing the possible mound and this is facing the field on the other side from the field. You barely see this Uh, from this side. This is about three, four feet tall. Yeah. And it zigzags and at the far end of the um, wall, it, um, water is running through it you can see where the wall used to be and the water has like uh, pushed away the wall over time yeah and where, where it used to be you can see quartz like the bottom of the wall was lined with quartz oh uh, and so i started seeing this and i was like what am i looking at here yeah <laughs> it didn't make it didn't, didn't make any sense you know yeah and, and so I, when we were up there doing you know walking around looking at this stuff it was very similar like on one side it's almost like the wall is working as a retaining wall. It's yeah. holding back. It's holding in all this. And, I, you know, it's hard to tell, like, was it designed for this or is, has, has all this stuff washed up against it over time? So yeah. that now that one side is completely buried, but if you can drop down on the other side and you can actually see the wall, it's hard to know, like, were they built as retaining walls or is this just something that happened over time? Yeah, that's the, that's the question. <laughs> yeah. It's like, which, and the, you know, you, could date this by just digging down and doing like carbon dating. Right. Uh, or OSL dating too. But then this is wall B. This is much, have much more buried. Right. But it's about the same width as the other wall. So I'm guessing it's probably around the same height. Yeah. But this one just has a lot more debris. Then on this one right here, you see that round shape right there Uh uh-huh there's the wall b in that round shape right next to it dude that's huge yeah yeah so they're trying to say that this is like glacial uh, moraine or um Uh, glacial deposits Hmm. yeah but uh, they don't look like glacial deposits i've ever seen (laughs) i feel like we've looked at a lot of those on cosmographia (laughs) <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. I don't remember ever seeing any with, with square, you know, with sharp corners. Yeah, it's weird. Yeah. And stonework in between it. Yeah. 